Hi, this is Crypto Digital. Today I'm going to be doing an update review on the Acer Iconia Tab A500. So, as you see, some things have changed since I did the review. Um, for one thing, I got this case. This case folds up like so, and it's leather, and all the ports are accessible. And um, what's really cool about it, other than the you know, neat strap that falls in the face and the camera, see there's a hole for the camera, but what's really neat about this is that you unfold it like so, and you can stand it up at different angles. So that's one. That's two. That's three. It's very easy. Uh, you can then you can type. You can uh, navigate the system. So, also, what's new is we've now got Android 3.1 uh, Honeycomb. So, um, last time I did the review, it was 3.0.1, now it's 3.1. So, that's, that's a great thing, because now, you can resize widgets, so you see my bookmarks, they're bigger now than they were last time, and what I can do is, I can resize the widget like so, make it smaller, or make it bigger. So you see more more fits on the page now. <coughs> and uh, that's always a good thing. And um, see we've got the clock widget, another clock widget, the date. Now something I forgot to uh, mention in the first review is that we've got these shelves for e-reading, games, multimedia, and social. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you games because I want to mention that this tablet came with Let's Golf, Need for Speed Shift, and Heroes of Sparta. So that's a great thing. That's a great thing. So uh, what else do we have here? Well, then we've got the Tegra Zone which is great because you've got your games, you know, Riptide GP is available for $6.99, um, Vendetta Online for free, you know, there's a lot of good things here. Um, then there's the Spotlight, which gives you news articles about games, and um, I downloaded some games. I downloaded Contract Killer, Galaxy on Fire 2 HD, and Dungeon Defenders. So, those are there. And uh, I've been playing Contract Killer a lot. Um, Galaxy on Fire 2 is supposed to be amazing. I've been reading articles about it, reviews. It looks amazing. It looks absolutely amazing. So. Can't wait to play Galaxy on Fire. Dungeon Defenders is also supposed to be very good. And then, well, that's about it. Um, resize the widgets. Um, comes with those games. Uh, originally, it came with those games as not a 3.1. Uh, update, but it, it just came with those games, the tablet, um, and these shelves, like reading, see it came with, well I think I installed the Nook app, but it came with movie read and books, and uh, then you've got multimedia, which I installed Nemo Player, but it came with Clearify, Wapio, Photo Browser 3D and Music A and YouTube. So you know, 
these shelves, I mean, it, it's it's a uh, it's a cool little thing. It's, it's something. So uh, and social, you know, things like Facebook and Twitter. Then you know, I've got my bookmarks here. You scroll up and down through the bookmarks, make the widget bigger or smaller. Um, I've been optimizing battery uh, by turning off updates for the emails, so I don't. It doesn't notify me when I get a new email, but I get a much better battery life because of it. So I recommend doing that uh, because the battery on this tablet is, you know, yeah, I'm not going to say it's uh, it's mid-range. It's, it's mediocre. It's not great. Um, but if you turn off the notifications, you get great battery life. Like this is lasting me. Um, maybe a week, maybe more on one charge because, you know, I don't use it that much and I've optimized the battery life. So I don't use live wallpapers, you know, I don't use the email notifications. Little things like that make a big difference. So uh, that's the follow up review of the Acer Iconia Tab A500. Um, that's it. Uh, take care until next time. Thanks for the review.